Here's your WTF Action News for Wednesday, November 20th. On Sunday, a 54-year-old Harrison man was killed after being hit by a car in Lake Township. State police say they had a report of a man lying on Mead Road near US-127 around 6 p.m. When troopers arrived, they found the man dead in the roadway, and it appeared that he had been walking along the shoulder, and the driver left the scene. During the investigation, the driver returned and was cooperative and consented to a blood test. The investigation is ongoing. Police in Grand Rapids say they have arrested the person who approached a student who was waiting for a bus. The student who was safe was waiting for a bus near Ball Avenue and Bradford Streets on Grand Rapids' northeast side. Grand Rapids Police and the Kent County Prosecutor's Office is working to file charges against the individual who was not identified. A former teacher in Emmett and Grand Traverse Counties was sentenced to 10 to 15 years in prison for having sex with a student at Concord Academy in Petoskey. John Van Patten's sentencing hearing followed his plea of no contest to 14 counts of third degree and two counts of fourth degree criminal sexual conduct. Van Patten was also formerly a teacher at the Grand Traverse Academy in Traverse City. A Bay City doctor is urging hunters to get a physical examination before heading into the woods after three died of heart attacks on the opening day of the firearm deer season. The heart attacks included a 65-year-old Bay City man and an 83-year-old Portage man who both died near Nat County. A 57-year-old man from Lincoln Park died in Tuscola County. According to the DNR, the season is off to a good start otherwise, with more than 174,000 deer harvested so far this year. Homeschoolers are invited to the Hair School branch of the Alcona County Library from 1 to 2 p.m. for inspiration and camaraderie. The Lincoln Pop-Up Pantry will be held at 3 p.m. this afternoon at the Coles Appliance Storage Building next to the Credit Union in Lincoln. The Cancer Support Group Friends Together will meet at the Alcona Elementary School Library this evening at 6.30. Stand by. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, and cue music. On this day in 2001, Madonna's childhood home in Oakland County sold at auction in just 12 minutes. The house, along with a few items of rock memorabilia, was purchased for $331,000. Gail Ann Dorsey was born on this day in 1962. The American bass guitarist and vocalist worked with David Bowie in the 90s, and has worked with Brian Ferry and Boy George. Today's 97.9 WTF weather forecast calls for rain mainly after 1 p.m. with the temperature falling to around 44 degrees by 5 p.m. West winds at 5 to 10 miles an hour becoming northwest this afternoon. Rain continues overnight possibly mixed with snow with a low around 33. Rain and snow continues into Thursday gradually becoming mostly sunny with a high near 44. WTF Action News is a public service of your local community radio station, WXTFLP Harrisville. Right here in Elkona County, Michigan.